Hi, it's me. Hope you are doing well. Thought I give you an update. So today on the Sunday, I finally decided to go for my first dose of vaccine. February this year, I received an invite for me to go for my vaccinations, but I was hesitant. I was hesitating, uh, considering whether or not to go uh, for it. Because I heard both good and bad thing about the vaccine. Good thing as in uh, once you have the vaccine, you are fully protected from COVID-19. So meaning you won't get COVID regardless what. And even if you do get COVID, it would you won't be severely ill. Uh, so you get will get minor symptoms, won't like will be warded or even death. Then I also heard another part of the story on the bad side where uh, it's a bit dark. Like uh, people were saying that the vaccine is a poison. It is a, a event to depopulate the whole world population. Meaning they have an agenda uh, made to depopulate. They don't need so many people in the earth, world, so they wanted to reduce the number of people on this earth. That's it. Uh, that what, what I heard uh, from my interview. Uh, so I was like hesitant to now a uh, couple of months. Uh, I was still the one to go. Until lately, uh, really, Bo Piena. You see what they did to us? Not fully vaccinated, we can't go to, even go to the cinema, buy a ticket and watch movie. Uh, we have to buy the ticket for the non-vaccinated uh, this uh, hall. And usually those hall are only one or two uh, each day and usually full will be very fast filled. And even if you can watch movie, you can't even eat and drink inside the theatre. So what's the point of going to the cinema if you can't eat and the only entertainment we have uh, is eat and drink and we can't dine in in restaurant, that restaurant or more than five people uh, we only can eat in coffee shop and hawker center not even like kopitiam anywhere that is like aircon or indoor if i have a choice i still won't go for the vaccine but you see what they did to us make us makes life so difficult for us uh, I have to part out before <laughs> dine-in, before karaoke, any indoor places or outdoor large venue, uh, cinema, a gym, all sorts of places uh, you will miss. So I was just thinking that the cases lately has been surging by uh, multiples of uh, last few weeks ago about average of 5,000 500 plus new cases a day so soon will be 1,000 over so and uh, people around me has all been vaccinated uh, next time work they might require you to be fully vaccinated uh, as well so I think it's uh, almost time now it's already so many restrictions next time it's a little bit worse don't allow you to travel if you are not fully vaccinated uh, so yeah, my family, uh, my sister all went and a few couple of months back ago. So, the caramel man is a hot wheel. Later you will be filming me a little of me having the vaccination shot. A little update on my job career. Uh, I'm now working as a security officer. SO. Security official in short. Uh, so I will be I working five days a week. Usually I can choose which day I want, but sometimes they, they need people, they will call me back, or some someday they, they already have people, they will deduct me. So I average about five days a week. Uh, my job is like patrolling, doing like guide house duty, when car enter the condo, we have to take down their details, visiting or debris, pick up, drop up. Like resident here, we have to uh, know, and also patrolling, clocking, and uh, doing the counter stuff. So I may progress 
I may continue to uh, upgrade myself. Next time I can become a senior security officer. If uh, six months in, I'm six months into the job and uh, uh, continue to upgrade with uh, more skill uh, and uh, eventually become supervisor or higher. But I, I'm not sure how long I'm going to work as this because like about three months from now I'll be helping my auntie, my mom's sister. She will be setting up her own uh, food production uh, business. I'll be helping her with uh, some uh, intake. We'll be at the store helping out and also uh, help her some debris, some back end work uh, with the payroll and such. So we will see. So here is the destination booth. Like that. See, a lot, uh, they allow me to film now. So just finished my destination. I waited half an hour there sitting there in the chair, waiting for my turn. They give this. They say I have to bring on my next uh, my second dose. Give a hand sterilizer, a bottle and uh, this 50 disposable mask. Uh, they say one week cannot drink alcohol and what they say. Uh, they say if it occurs uh, some symptoms like a flu or fever. Uh, just take Panadol, as easy as they say lah. Hope we won't occur. So now I going to watch movie. So three weeks from now I will have my second dose. Hope everything is fine. Hopefully you will see me again if I'm still alive. So hope you have a week uh, weekend. Uh, if you can, don't vaccinate in your country. Don't go if you have to. Go for it. Take care.